Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, and today this video is about Microsoft's Windows 11 Insider Preview Build, 22635.2483, which is released to the beta channel, starting with this build. As a reminder, all Windows Insiders in the beta channel will now be on the same build, build 22635, via an enablement package. For Windows Insiders in the beta channel who want to be the first to get features gradually rolled out to you, you can turn on the toggle to get the latest updates as they are available via Settings, Windows Update. Over time, Microsoft will increase the rollouts of features to everyone with the toggle turned on. Going forward, Microsoft will document changes in beta channel builds in two buckets, new features, improvements, and fixes that are being gradually rolled out for insiders who have turned on the toggle to get the latest updates as they are available and then new features, improvements, and fixes available to everyone in the beta channel. Please note that for today's flight to the beta channel, there are no new features or improvements rolling out specifically for insiders who have turned on the toggle. Now moving forward, and talking about the changes and improvements gradually being rolled out to everyone in the beta channel. For Emoji, Microsoft is temporarily disabling the update of our color font format to Color V1. First introduced in build 22631.2265, that displayed richer emoji with a 3D-like appearance to fix some bugs. Microsoft plans to re-enable this in a future beta channel flight. For other changes, in the European Economic Area EEA, Windows will now require consent to share data between Windows and other signed-in Microsoft services. You will see some Windows features start to check for consent now, with more being added in future builds. Without consent to share data between Windows and other signed-in Microsoft services, some functionality in Windows features may be unavailable, for example certain types of file recommendations under recommended on the start menu. Now talking about the fixes for everyone in the beta channel, fixed an issue which was causing search to crash on launch for some insiders in the previous flight. So that was all from Microsoft for this build. If you want to know more, follow the link to the official Microsoft blog from the description. Hope it was useful consider like for the video. Subscribe to the channel and if you have any questions, just comment down below. Thanks for watching and have a great day ahead.